Welcome oh, back. hey, welcome back, Ozarks Fox AM. We are full of sugar. Hey, I just, uh, the, I thought the week was flying faster than it was. It's not Tuesday. It is Monday, which means Kaylee's not doing entertainment news. She's going to talk about our veterans. Good morning, Kaylee. Yeah, Veterans Day is Wednesday. You know, they fought for our country and our freedoms right? now. They're getting a service in return. It's all about them. Our veterans are in for a special treat this Veterans Day. It's actually my first week here. I had a young Marine. I had just had an Air Force veteran. Veterans have given our country their service. I was in for five years. I was in South Korea and um, Iraq. And now they're getting a service in return. We want to celebrate our veterans and thank them in every way that we can. On November 11th, Jennings Barber Station is honoring veterans with half off any service. The rest of the money made from their service is being donated. Our barbers are donating their um, part of the service that they would normally make to Camp Valor. Camp Valor is a nonprofit in Missouri that takes veterans on guided hunting and fishing trips. If they're disabled, if they're in a wheelchair or any of that, they can still experience the outdoors. They still get to shoot guns, ride four-wheelers, go fishing, and it's all with a guide. So they're always with somebody that can assist them. Memories of long ago are fading. Especially of, of older veterans, their stories are, are slowly disappearing. But their brave legacies live on. Especially like with the election that just happened, it's because of veterans that we even get a voice. Proving that the battles once fought. They walk in here and you just don't know until you just start talking to them and you know they'd start telling their story. Are never forgotten. They sacrificed everything for us and giving back to them is such a small thing that we can do. There's also a raffle going on until November 11th at Jennings Barber Station in Republic with the drawing taking place the day after November 12th. Up for grabs are American flag cornholes, cheap tumblers, two $50 gift cards to Jennings Barber Station, $25 Bass Pro gift card, a survival kit, a shotgun shell bottle opener, and a Camp Valor hoodie. It's only a few dollars for a raffle ticket and you can get as many raffle tickets as you want. That sounds great. I love that they're giving back to the veterans. That's that's yeah. incredible. Love Again, that. those half price haircuts and other services for veterans are it, that's all happening on Wednesday and the rest of those proceeds are going to Camp Valor. Fantastic. That's so great. Yeah, that is great, isn't it? I love there's something good about a, a good old fashioned barbershop that just I, I get my haircut at a barbershop and yeah. I just like it. There's something about it. Yeah. And it just makes you feel like you're stepping back in time and yeah. you know. And I also every time I get a haircut, I thank the Lord I'm not a female. <laughs> Yeah, it takes you guys so long to get your hair cut and colored. It does take. Oh, well, it takes yeah, forever. that is true. I've worked in a barbershop for a little while, and there is something nostalgic about it. Yeah, it is. I, I, no, yeah. it really is. I, I appreciate that. Speaking yeah. of back in time, if someone is just listening to this segment right here, we threw it back in time today mm -hmm. because it was supposed to be the last day in the '70s weather-wise, so we thought we would do a 70s sort of theme today. And I, you look fabulous. You I, do. Where'd you get those boots, Kaylee? I have had them since high school. Have Seriously? you really? Yeah. They're um, super cute. They are super Good cute. Good thing about feet is they don't grow. Oh, what? hey, Kaylee, what? you're not you're not old enough to know that answer. Uh, yeah, they do. Uh, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> yeah, wait do. a minute. You, I thought feet do. No, I had, no. Well, uh, let do me they? just tell you that, um, yes, I've talked to many people uh, after pregnancies and, uh, and just after you're living your life, my feet are definitely a uh, size bigger than they were 20 years are ago. Are you serious? Oh. Absolutely. I do know that men's noses and ears grow as we get older. That's right. I do know that's coming. By the way, I want to point <laughs> out like my 70s socks as yep. well. This is Bob Ross from the 70s. Yes. Happy little trees. Happy Even my socks it. are 70s. That's great. We're all, hey, Kaylee, you've got little people to start with, so you're, you're not Worry about no worries about that. Okay. Hey, guess what? Up next, we're getting all the details of this year's Branson Market Days with Jana Goodwin. Yeah, right. me. Should we hustle it out, y'all? Let's hustle it out. <laughs>